Romans 10 verse 1 to 4 says, My brothers and sisters, how I wish with all my heart that my own people might be saved. How I pray to God for them. I can assure you that they are deeply devoted to God, but their devotion is not based on true knowledge. They have not known the way in which God puts people right with himself. And instead, they have tried to set up their own way. And so they did not submit themselves to God's way of putting people right. For Christ has brought the law to an end, so that everyone who believes is put right with God. Now my understanding of this text is simple. Is that we can fool ourselves in thinking that we are devoted to God. And yet we want to come up with our own way of going to God. I was so shocked when I found a pastor coming out with a man as his husband and saying that God is love. That pastor is devoted to God. His husband is devoted to God. But they have no knowledge, on, they have no true knowledge of how people are being put right with God. Even though Christ has put an end to the law, but commandments still remains. Jesus himself said, I did not come here to change commandments, but I am adding on one. And he, the, the, the commandment that he added on, he said that love each other. So what are you doing? What are you doing? That is not of true knowledge. Because the scripture says that all who believes in Christ shall be put right with God. Through your faith, you shall, through your faith in Christ, you shall be put right with God. So what is it that we as human beings are trying to prove by doing things our own way? God sacrificed his only son. He did not have to do that. Do people understand that God could have literally destroyed the entire earth with all human beings and started over? He did not need to send his son. He did not need to save us. He did not need to come down and cleanse us of our sins and save us from our sins. He did not need it. He, he, he did not need that. He didn't need to do that but he did it because of his mercy and his love so what is it that we are holding on to stop holding on to false knowledge we need to understand the true knowledge of how we're going to be put right with god and live according to it we as christians are falling off the bear we are falling off God sent Jesus Christ to save us, but we do not want to be saved. We are stubborn. Even I recently had to come to a conclusion that it doesn't matter how much of my Bible I can read, but if I do not make it into church, if I do not make it into the house of God, I will still be insufficient. There will always be something missing. We need to do we need to follow Christ all the way. And we need to stop doing it halfway and expecting God to have mercy on us. We need to stop being lazy and start finding the right devotion so that we can be put right with God. Amen.